good evening ladies and good evening good morning ladies and gentlemen welcome back to another video so i haven't been fishing a lot recently i've been just guiding heaps i know i keep saying that but i honestly haven't fished since probably october had a lot of family down had my son and granddaughter back home uh over christmas through most of january so that was really good and uh now it's time for me to take a holiday so i'm back in the south island I drove down on the ferry, drove down last night, jumped on the ferry, drove over to where I am now, which is very, very top of the south. And uh, this is actually the salt water. So I'm gonna spend my first two days up here looking for big old kingfish out there. Conditions aren't gonna be perfect. It's gonna be a bit of wind or enough wind to make it maybe a nuisance. And today we're gonna to have this gray cloud cover. So I don't know, I'm gonna persevere. The conditions tomorrow are much better, should be bright and sunny. But uh, I just checked the forecast again, there could be a little bit more wind, which isn't ideal. But we're going to persevere. I'm going to give two days up here before I start traveling south and uh, doing a big lap of the South Island and catching some trout. Maybe I'll spend another couple of days here at the end of the trip, I'm not sure. But anyway, I'm super excited to be on a trip like this again. This is what I need to do. This is what gets me excited these days. Um, so I've got like about 25 days, I think, all up to do to pretty much circumnavigate the South Island go down go up go across you name it I'm just going to chase the good weather got a couple of people that are going to join me on the trip i.e my wife we're going to do some hikes and uh she's going to come fishing for three or four days good mate Dan who's been in a couple of videos and uh, good mate Lance who's been in heaps of videos good mate Adam who's been in a couple of videos I'm going to meet up with a bunch of people as I travel around and uh catch some fish so yeah do me a huge favor subscribe to the channel we're so close to that hundred thousand just uh, so many of you guys, I look at the analytics, like I can't remember the number now, but like it's like less than half, half, more than half the people that watch this channel aren't subscribed, but they keep coming back watching. So just do me that favor, click subscribe, click the bell, do all that good stuff. Anyway, I'm gonna have this coffee, rig up a rod, get my boots on, see what the day brings. Doopy doop doo, doopy doop doo. Let's go catch a big king fish. It's crazy, like I've put in a few days king fishing up north this year, four days. I've hooked one, two, about four kingfish and I've only landed one. Such an elusive species for me. When I first started I used to catch a bunch, it seemed easy. Maybe I'm getting old and a bit slower or something. Like they seem hard to catch at the moment. Last time I was here, I've caught a couple of fish off these flats before. But the last time I was here, I hooked two, landed none. Maybe I hooked three. So anyway, I'm back this year for revenge. Ooh, got my feet wet. This is nice. Conditions for spotting anything are really bad. So the only thing that's going to give it away is a tail poking out, a little boil, a wake, something like that. So you kind of just got to keep your eyes peeled. And uh, on a day like today, hope for the best. I think walking into the sun is not a good idea, so I think I'm going to go out as far as I'm comfortable, probably a little over knee deep, then turn around and come back in with the tide because my visibility this way is a little bit better. And uh, yeah, let's see what happens. Oh, yep, there's a wake right in front of me, actually. Yep, oh, this could be fish. If that's yellow, it's yes, that's kingfish right there. Oh my god, there was a fish just tailing right in front of me. does not want to pop her so oh man these things make you shake look at look you, do you guys ever see me shake like this in front of trout I doubt it oh my lord so many fish so many opportunities I've probably cast it the most kingfish I've ever cast at maybe 10 12 fish <sighs> fell hooked array that's not ideal 
Yeah, so I, I went to have lunch, but I ended up just talking to some people and flying the drone. Got some amazing footage with the drone. Hopefully I can catch fish so I can tie this all together into an epic video because I really want to use that those drone shots. Those are some of the coolest footage I think I've ever got. Anyway, I've left. There's a ton of people fishing down there. There's a heap of fish, but they're all just getting mega harassed. Uh, so I am going to walk this beach a little bit. See if I can see some wakers and then I'm going to go further that way as well. But I'm just going to run and gun basic. Just going to have the GoPro with me and a GoPro in my hip pack. I'm going to leave everything like this, this camera in the car. Anyway, let's go see what happens. Yes! Finally! I think it's just a small fish, but I will take it. Oh, thank God. Yes. This fish looked tiny. I'm stoked. Stoked. Man, I have just about given up. I've tried every fly in my box more than once. Is this a car wire? I think I just caught a car wire off a, a ray. I don't think I've ever done that. I don't think I have ever caught a car wire off a ray. But hey, here you go. First time for everything. Oh, these things are so strong. Come here, buddy. Whoa, fish one under my feet. Jeez, that's a tank. That's a tank cowboy. That's freaking huge. Look at that. That's a good cowboy. I don't think I've ever caught a cowboy off a off a ray. Not exactly what I was after. But a cool flats fish nonetheless. I'll keep uh, persevering and see what we can find. See you buddy. Oh friends, buddies, pals, how you doing? Look at that, glorious, no wind, very little cloud and uh, day two on the old trying to catch kingfish mission. Saw so many yesterday, it was ridiculous. Um, I probably got like seven or eight, 19, 11, 12 shots, who knows. Uh, a couple of lazy follows. Caught that big car way, which was pretty cool. Pretty exciting. I thought I was in there for a while on a kingfish, but just a rather large car way. Anyway, I'm going to get all geared up and I'm going to get back out there. And hopefully today is the day, because I haven't caught a fish off this off in this area for a couple of, couple of trips now. So, fingers crossed. There's a couple of kingfish here in front of me somewhere. I think I see one here. I think these might be free swimmers. There's two of them. Three of them. I'm sure this is some fish. just vanished that was a fucking sick if that wasn't a kingfish it was a bloody good shot oh he's right here eat it eat it oh my god okay they are kingfish followed it lazily And the stingray, but it doesn't look like it has any fish. Bugger. So this is what I'm looking for. This big guy right here, finally found one. And uh, it's got no fish. 
Why do you have no fresh stingray? Would you please go and find some for me? Thank you. Oh yep, here they are. Come on, give me my shot, give me my kingfish. Give me my fish. Yes! <sighs> Finally. I'm not sure what's going on with my GoPro. I think I got the hook up and it stopped. I think it's too hot. But uh, I've been hooked up to this fish for a couple of minutes now. It didn't, it didn't look like the biggest one on the ray. And man, it took a lot of casts and a few fly changes, but we, we finally hooked up. Please stay on, I need this fish. Thank you. 